Moral Missing Threat. Alright, so welcome to or welcome back to the channel. Uh, if you're new here, welcome. I'm D D D Damien, and this is my not a reaction channel. I am not a reaction channel. I just do like 87.3666% reactions on this channel. Uh, and that's that's okay. Uh, some people like that. Uh, you might like that. I don't know. Just take a, take a gander through my channel. Go back and watch some other videos and see what you think. Uh, we do other content here though. We do like some fragrance kind of stuff. Um, kind of stuff and I know I say in every video uh, today we're doing something different today we are doing something different uh, I'm doing a haul video today yeah that that's weird and different for me right it's it's not I always find a way to justify saying like oh we're doing something different today it will it's legit like so I'm sure many of you are probably have gotten advertisements for or are familiar with on some level Timu. Maybe you already shop with them. It's a website, Timu.com. It's very similar to like Wish or uh, Shein or something like that. Um, anyway, you know, uh, I, I did a, a Timu haul. They reached out to me. Um, so, uh, you know, I ordered a bunch of stuff and, uh, you know, told them that I would give them an honest review on this stuff so that's what we're gonna do today I don't even remember what all I ordered uh, I, re I remember I ordered I think 10 or so items I've already uh, I, I cut I use this this knife I didn't get this knife from Timu but I, I really like this knife uh, I cut into the bag that they shipped in um, and I pulled this out of it this really nifty it's really nice Timu bag um, I pulled that out um, and I started, um, I was about to start doing this video. Uh, I'd already started recording when I cut that bag and did this whole f***ing intro. But then I realized that my air conditioner and my fan were on, so the sound quality was probably total oh. So, uh, luckily I, I realized it before I did the whole video. Uh, but so let's jump into this. Um, the, you know, this is, this, so this is, this is, there's more stuff in, in the bag. There's another bag in there. So, uh, this is, this is the one we're starting off with because it's, it looks like it's a bigger bag than the other one. But so, okay, snapbacks. I know I ordered snapbacks. I love snapbacks. So this one, okay, this is, uh, this, oh yeah, this is, okay, so this one is embroidered. I think. This was like three dollars and some change, or maybe four dollars and some change. I can't remember, but um, let's see. Okay, yeah, this is this is fresh. It's got the the you know embroidered. This is embroidered. It's it's pretty nice actually. Um, yeah, this I might wear this in my next video perhaps. This for for three dollars and some change, I believe. It's like 340 or 380 or something, maybe 392. I'll have to I'll have to see if they included a packing slip and what the price is. I can't remember, but this is um, for that price. You can't beat this. Uh, I'm I'm down with it. I'm 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 digging it. Okay, so we've got another snapback. Um, this one has the uh, the bandana style print on the bill which I dig and again I think this was like three dollars and some change perhaps um, but the quality yeah it's like it's like screen printed it's uh, it's not bad uh, for that for that price this is this is doable uh, and, and I dig this I will probably it, it seems it seems pretty decent quality um, we'll give it a few wears and see how it holds up same with the other one uh, but these will be these will be good for future videos that's what, kind of why I got them um, speaking of future videos, something I, I haven't, if you notice, my background, this is all real, real stuff here, um, cause, uh, yeah, the whole, uh, I haven't had a green screen for a hot minute now, uh, so, I, uh, I ordered a green screen. I, I really. Oh damn it! It was like. Okay, so it came in this bag. 
um, and it was taped right here and I was trying to undo the tape so I could unzip the bag to see the quality of the screen but I tore the the bag because this tape apparently is really strong um, I can't really even I can't get the little zipper over the the tape is intense um, the zipper came off the bag that's well, whatever. I don't really need the bag per se, but uh, let's see what kind of quality this screen is. It would be interesting to test it out and see how it chromas in my editing software. But uh, okay, I mean, it doesn't it doesn't seem bad. Hold up to the light. I can see through it in the light a little bit. Um, but that's okay. I can put like some backing up behind it or something. I don't know how the lighting's going to be. Um, so I can't really say too much about this just yet. Perhaps I'll have to do a whole other video with this just to see, you know, because um, I can't really test it right now. I mean, I guess technically I could. I mean, I can't. I don't really want to unfold it all the way and then have to fold it back up just to put a background behind me and see how it, well, you know, I could just, I mean, it's, the thickness is going to be off, but, you know, um, I'll try to, try to chroma this in editing and see, like, what we, what we think, oh, what was, something fell out, oh, clamps, oh, little clamps or whatever to put it, like, on, wherever, so, yeah, it comes with, with these, I think this was like maybe eleven dollars, maybe I I can't remember, but I think that's uh, it was in that general price range, I believe, somewhere between eleven and fifteen. But I'm thinking it was closer to eleven. Honestly. Okay, so we've got that. Um, what else did we get? So that's three things. I feel like there was a lot more. Okay, so we got another bag here. Another Timu bag. We got quite a few items in here. Let's see if we got everything, what everything is, because I don't really honestly remember. Okay, so I got this white box here. Um, I don't know what's in this. But we're about to find. Oh, there's a battery. Oh, I know what this is. Ah, hell yeah. This is a, it's a flashlight. I needed a new flashlight, a small one that with a, with a clip on it that was a uh, USB chargeable that I could clip onto my vest for work, but also still have it at home to use as like a tactical little safety kind of situation. So it, it takes, it looks like a lithium ion battery. Um, This looks like an 18650. Yeah, this is an 18650. I got a bunch of 18650s, but they don't have the nipple on them. So, um, but yeah, so we got that, and it's can rechargeable with this, and it's got the little the little port on here. Um, I wonder if the battery is already charged, and we can like test this bad boy out. Um, Guess that goes in that way. Wait, am I supposed to tear this plastic off? I feel like I should probably take yes. I should. Turns. I thought maybe it 
change the diameter but apparently it doesn't but oh shit okay I mean this is a it's still a cool flashlight um I think this was like maybe three or four dollars uh I can't remember it might it might have been five um but I mean I guess it's it's really not bad for a little flashlight like this for what you know what what its intended use is going to be and such you know that's cool all right uh what else so well, this is the lapel uh mic set that i got um you know so if i want to start doing videos where i'm doing like uh shit out and about where i have somebody else or like i'm interviewing people or i just want to do skits or something uh, and you know I don't have really mics for it um, I don't really know that this I might have to do a whole separate video on this to let you you guys know like the quality and how well this works I mean we're just gonna kind of we're gonna kind of look at them right now and just see how they look we can't I don't know if we can really test how they perform I might have to do a whole other video for that like I was just saying um figure out how to open damn okay oh wow okay so we got two mics and they got the we got these these two mics it comes in a, in a package like this so um we got two mics they got these clips on them for the you know to clip them where we need to clip them and this middle receiver that uh, I guess will plug right into the uh, mic jack on your DSLR uh, camera or your phone or uh, your laptop or whatever device you're going to be using. Uh, and then it's got this, it's got a little box in it. It looks like a USB. B cord design on the box. Is that what it is? Yeah, it's a little uh, USB 3.0 to regular USB cord for like phones, I guess. All right, cool, cool. So we got. I'm anxious to see how this works out. Um, we're definitely gonna have to do a test on that. Um, see what else uh what is this i know what this is okay so this oh and that that uh mic set was like 12 dollars i think this okay this for three dollars this isn't bad um so this is a two-point rifle sling um, yeah, this is this is this is for a rifle. Um, so yeah, uh, I'll have to let you guys know once I hook this up to a rifle um, how that is. What else do we got? Um, okay, so this is again to go. Oh no, I lost a tool. Mm -mm. This comes with a little tool. This is a little uh, Allen wrench. It's a little bag. Uh, and this, this is the detachable the M lock setup for the rifle to be able to. Yeah. Uh, just to be able to. So the M lock will go on. Can I. Sh am I a. This is like the, this is the M lock of the rifle. Um, so this, what what will happen is this particular rifle already has a one point down here. This for a sling. What are you doing, Miss Cookie? Miss Cookie, Cookie. What are you? Look at this little Cookie baby. What are you doing, Miss Baby Girl? Miss Cookbook. Miss Cookie Babe. Sweet girl, be 
but yeah, so this M lock. Don't worry, there, there, the right. There's nothing chambered in the rifle. There's no magazine in the rifle. This rifle is clear and safe. So one of these M lock attachments will go on, like, right here. So this is like the M lock attachment and the bolt. It'll go somewhere in one of these holes, and the attachment will go on to that and then the two point sling will attach to the rifle so I can cook, cook, baby cook. All right, so we still got we still got more in the bag. Miss Cookie's really interested in this. It looks like we got two more things. Alright, so one we've got this green box that just says made in China and FO28 um, I think I think I know what this is I ordered some knives oddly enough me knives who would have thunk um, so yeah let's uh I think that's probably what this is yeah that is okay this is a this is a, a folding knife. It's not a spring assisted like mine, but uh, it just looks pretty tough, right? I mean, this is like pretty sick looking knife. Um, it's just a good little extra thing to have in any kind of tactical survival kit, you know. Um, uh, which I'm putting together several of. How the? Okay, so this is this is weird. It does not. It does not have a standard locking, the kind of locking mechanism that I would expect it to have. Cersei, get out of the rifle, okay? Yeah, this, uh, so this, this, it, it doesn't lock. Like, once it's open, like, I mean, it's not going to close if you're pressing down this way, but, I mean, it's not going to stay locked. There's not, like, the push in back here. There's not the, the push in under the blade. There's nothing to lock the blade in place. Um, this was like seven or eight bucks, I think. Um, it looks cool. I like the handle. Uh, I don't like the fact that it doesn't lock. Um, that's my only gripe so far. Uh, so this other, the other box I got, I'm, I'm excited about this because I saw that Browning logo with the gun and uh, you know if you know anything about Browning yeah so I, I'm excited about this one uh, I know this is also a knife obviously uh, well not obviously because I just said that you know guns um, but damn it But yeah, this this is a knife, though. I know that much. Um, this is going to be more of a tactical style knife. Yeah, this. I like this bad boy. Look at this. Um, it's got all the little the things you need. Look at that blade down in there. If you can see that. Uh, see if this is spring assisted. Well, no, it's not, but um, it's still, you know, it's got the, the, the Browning logo on the blade, if you can see that. Uh, but I love the color of this knife. Uh, I love this. I love the style and the color and everything about this. Um, and the blade does lock. It's got the, the release right here to be able to fold it closed. Um, and you can, it, it's not, it doesn't flip out, but I mean, it, it definitely, it open, it, you can open it quickly and easily. I mean, not, not like that, but, you know, you can 
So it, it's it, this this will do. This will definitely. This is good for a tactical kit for sure. Um, and I think this one was like nine bucks, uh, which you know, again, that's for that night. I think that's a really good price. Um, there is no packing slip. Oh wait, what 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 is this? <gasps> oh, I forgot. Oh, that's fucking great. I forgot about this. There was one more little thing. Um, so this is this is a, key, a keychain. I got a I got a keychain. I haven't had a keychain in so long, but I thought this would be amazing. It's like a little little kitty with a knife in its mouth. Just walking around holding a knife. That's uh, that's so me. You know what I mean? Um, this is like a dollar something. Um, probably not the the greatest quality in the world, but um, for a dollar, it's like a dollar twenty-eight. I think um, not bad, not bad at all. Like I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put this on my key ring. Um, and we'll see how well it holds up. Uh, I know there was a pin like this that I almost ordered for my, uh, my vest at work, but I didn't. Um, I got the keychain instead because I was like, you know what? I don't have a keychain. Um, but you know, we'll, 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 we'll mess with it and see what we think. Um, all in all, for everything we got, we got the, the two hats. They were like three or four dollars, you know, a piece. Uh, we're satisfied with those, the good quality. Uh, the knives, the browning knife was awesome. The other one looks awesome. Um, we just don't like the non-locking mechanism, but uh, the actual, the quality in the build, um, it's still pretty sturdy. Oh, I just uh, just now realized it said it has AK-47 on the blade. AK-47 CCCP. Um, that's pretty sick. So this, um, it's still, for the price and the quality, I think it's still a great knife. Uh, the browning, of course. Uh, again, these are both, I think, really, really good knives. Um, I'm satisfied with these. Then we've got the green screen. We got the M lock for the rifle. We got the keychain. We got the flashlight. Um, what else? We got the flashlight, green screen, the rifle sling, and the microphone set. So, all in all, I think all of this all together came out to just a little over $60. I think it was $65 total for green screen, two hats, two knives, a flashlight, lapel mic kit, M-lock, uh, rifle sling, and uh, the keychain. Like all of that, I think all together came out to around $65, which honestly is in my opinion, a really, a really good deal. Um, there was a ton of other stuff that I wanted that, um, who knows, maybe after this video, maybe they'll let me get some more stuff. I don't know. But yeah, uh, I think all of this is definitely stuff worth checking out. It's worth getting. I'll leave links to all of it in the description of this video and, you know, a personal code and you can go and use that and you can get some cool items and you can get a really awesome discount to get started and, uh, you know, just use my, my code and my link and everything. And, uh, you know, thanks for watching. Thanks for supporting the channel. Um, I got some really exciting stuff coming if you like firearms. Yeah, uh, but in the meantime, for now, I'm going to go. I'm going to run.